Ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, everybody. Glad you've made the decision to be with us. Alongside Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. We're glad to be bringing you action and welcoming you to Boardwalk Hall and the famed Atlantic City Boardwalk in southern New Jersey for our main event of the evening. Ten rounds of heavyweight action. And the anticipation for this bout has grown as the week has gone on. A lot of talk behind these two. Now it's time to walk the walk. Kid Dynamite's ring walk is very interesting here. This isn't over-the-top emotion. This isn't a guy with an intense, glaring stare. Just a guy going to do his job. Alexander's coming to the ring with his entourage of cornermen. But they look calm, cool, and collected. Hard to believe that they're going to be firing off punches within moments. His adversary, hailing out of St. Petersburg, Express Alexander! Well, they're scheduled to spend a half an hour swapping leather. This is a 10-rounder. Oh, he took some damage, but he gave some back with the right hand. And now you see the southpaw pulling the trigger with the straight left. Got to be accurate to send the combination to the body, and he does that. In and out! In and nice out! Nice block by Express. Takes one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Like oh, that. a nice like two-punch combo by Express. Referee gives him a warning for headbutting. Blocks away that headshot. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. There you go. Look at that combination by Express. That's a well-scored left hand by Alexander. Scored well with the hook. We're seeing a lot of work to the body here early on by him. Teddy, is that a certain mentality, these guys that commit to being a body puncher? Yeah, because they understand that the body punching, you know, that's not something that's glorious. That's not something that, you know, one like a two, great left hook two. on the chin, bang, it gets results right away. They understand that that's something that pays off later. And something you got to start early and stay with. A well-targeted classic one-two by Alexander. Quick snapping hook, and it does damage. Keep pushing. Yeah, that's it. Good job, buddy. And that round is in the books, and that one should go into the record books. It's been all action all night, but that chapter in the book was something special. Oh, it was, Joe. You know, sometimes you go to a party, you don't know what to expect. You wind up getting guys that like to talk. They come right in, they introduce themselves. Well, here, you get guys that like to fight. Nice, solid left hand scored by Express. Looking good. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Kid Dynamite. Targeting that one-two. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. 
Kid Dynamite's blocking ability is doing well for him there. He's getting rid of that punch from his opponent. Well blocked by Kid Dynamite. Express is fully committed to utilizing the jab. And I think it's working out well for him early on. Well, it is. It's kind of like, you know, sending static out there. You, you want to scramble nice. somebody's nice. radio signal. You know, that's what the jab does. Oh, he gets hit by a left hand that he had no clue on. Really good work right there, landing the two punches in sequence. By Express's run. Oh, a big shot comes home for him. He goes down in the later stages of this round. He's going to try to survive it. Alexander's back up on his feet. What will he look like in the next few moments of this fight? That's the big question. End of the round. So he scores the knockdown and now heads back to his corner. Teddy, do you ever have to calm a guy down after he scored a knockdown? That's a really great point because a lot of times that can be the turning point, but not for your guy that scored the knockdown, for the other guy. Because sometimes when you score a knockdown, you start to think it's going to be an easy night. And you forget what you knew when you came in. That wasn't going to be an easy night. You are going to have to bring all the tools out of the tool shed. And it's important to remember that. Back to the body. Oh, what an uppercut. He comes back with the left hand again. Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Alexander. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. That's a fierce left hand that landed by Kid Dynamite. Scored well up top. Alexander's got the mentality right now of fine. Bombs away. He went down earlier, and now he sees this as his only way of getting back in this fight. Yeah, he's behaving like a guy out in the street. And that's okay for a guy out in the street. You get desperate, you act a little amateurish, you just start throwing bombs, hoping to get rid of the guy. But it's not okay if you're a professional fighter. He's going to pay a price for this. Express's work in training camp is now paying off. Do you see the accuracy and the effectiveness with that combination? yourself ten clicks of the talk and that's the end of round three Having put his opponent down on the canvas, he's already easily taken the first three rounds of this fight as we begin round number four, Teddy. Well, it has been easy for him because his opponent has no defense. He just walks in and he's eating punches. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here tonight? Well, two aspirin and then, oh no, actually I would say a little counter punching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for us. The left hand coming into play by Kid Dynamite. Boy, sharp two punch combination by Alexander. Expresses scoring with that right hand. See some more head movement. Oh. Hey, Scores up top with a left. Good plus shot by Kid Dynamite. Just like that. 
Solid hook. Adam boy. Good job on the two punch combo by Kid Dynamite. Solid left hand to the head. A headshot blocked. Good job with another left hand. Let's go. What are you waiting for? You want this fight? You no. Know. Then let's get moving out there. This guy's gonna win this fight. If you don't take control, son, you need to take control. Another round underway, but how many more will we see? You get the sense this fight could be heading towards a stoppage. Nice work, the left hand to the head. Lands flush with the two-punch combo by Alexander. Keep working the body! Nice strike after catching one by Alexander. Jabbing a straight by Express. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Good job. It was sudden, it was fast, it was direct by Kid Dynamite. There's the headshot, but he parries it away. at him with a left hand. He just missed that shot up top. Express's cut is on the cheek, and you can see that it's bothering him a bit right now. That's something we'll keep our eye on. Alexander's left now getting into the mix. Good job protecting himself. Keep that hand moving. Well targeted, one two by Alexander. Get right. <laughs> See, that's some fine defense right there. I love that block by Kid Dynamite. Kid Dynamite's left, landing well. Express is nailed by a shot upstairs. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. And that's the end of round five. One of his eyes is completely shut. They want this fight to continue on. They want to give themselves every chance they have to win it. What do they need to do? Well, what they need to do is be very calm in a corner, get pressure on that cut, get the right medicines in there, and maybe find a way to fool around in the corner somehow, dump some water, you know, in the corner, where the referee has to spend a little bit more time cleaning it up. They want to get a little bit more seconds. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Alexander. A crushing two-punch combo by Alexander. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left-hand scores. Scored well up top. He returns the favor with a right hand of his own. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. Kid Dynamite's in a very nice rhythm right now, landing the uppercut on the inside. If he can stay with that, he can do some serious damage. And the damage he can do is put something on top of that uppercut, Joe. He needs to do that. The uppercut picks up the head, put the hook up top to take it off. That's a great combination. Headshot lands was a hook. An accurate left by Kid Dynamite. Good flush shot upstairs. Alexander's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. 
Working our way towards the bell. Last 10 seconds of the sixth. To the head he goes with a left hand. And that's the end of round six. The Dynamite's plan that his corner put forth throughout all training camp was exactly what we're seeing here. Fighting from the outside, scoring at will. His opponent, they haven't solved it once. And I'm shocked because, you know what? There's tape on this guy. There's video out there. We knew that he was going to fight this kind of fight. How did they not know and how did they not prepare for it? Resourceful one-two combo by Express. Alexander's now feeling the after effects of being rocked by a huge hook to the head. Trying to time that straight left hand, and he does so with ease. Scored well up top. Good combination on the one-two by Kid Dynamite. Staying away from those headshots with his defense up top. That's the clean shot with the left hand that he was looking for by Kid Dynamite. Alexander's hitting the mark right now. How precise was he there with that three-punch combo? At the halfway point of round seven. Come on, Kid, focus! Express's offense has completely gone away here, it seems. He was hurt earlier, and now all he's doing is worried about what could be coming to get him again. Yeah, he was on the highway earlier going about 90, and now all of a sudden he's taking those back roads going about 20. How long until the police catch up to him or his opponent pulls him over? Left hand came after the jab. Ten seconds to go in the seventh. Alexander's punch is far off the target. And that does it for this round. Hit Dynamite's in control of this fight with a commanding lead on your scorecard, Teddy, as we start round number eight. He just looks like the kind of guy that's not going to be defeated tonight. No, he's made up his mind. And he didn't make his mind up, you know, and this is for the young fighters out there and whatever you aspire to do to move forward. He didn't make up his mind tonight. It was made up way before he got in the ring, and it's showing. He's getting the payoff. <laughs> wow, a big flush blow, the left hand by Kid Dynamite. Good flush shot upstairs. Wow demolished like that was a wrecking ball one punch power oh ends God. the evening Your you gotta love that Alexander's power turns things around he goes from trailing on your scorecard to winning by knockout that's what's great about this sport, and that's why people always come out to watch it, because you can make everything right in the world, or at least that night you can make everything right in the ring. He made it right. I'm Joe Tessitore for Teddy Atlas saying thanks for being with us, and enjoy the rest of your night.